If you wish to practice sexing, observe phenotypes, or use your fruit flies for genetic crosses, your flies will need to be immobilized. Our FlyNap anesthetic is an easy to use, safe, effective, and inexpensive way to anesthetize flies. It is not explosive like ether, and a single exposure to FlyNap safely anesthetizes young Drosophila for 50 minutes to several hours. Fruit flies can be anesthetized in an empty vial, in a Drosophila anesthetizer, or in a culture vessel. When anesthetizing fruit flies in an empty vessel, gently tap the bottom and sides of the culture vial on a padded surface to move the flies to the bottom of the vial. Quickly transfer the flies from the culture vial into an empty one and plug the new vial. Dip the absorbent end of the anesthetic wand in the FlyNap solution, making sure to remove excess liquid. Use one finger to push the plug in the anesthetizing vial slightly to one side. Quickly stick the anesthetic end of the wand into the vial. Position it beside the plug so that the anesthetic tip is below the plug. Keep the culture vial upright with the wand in place. Watch the flies closely and remove the wand when 90 to 95% of the flies have fallen asleep. If it is not possible to transfer flies into an empty vial, lay the culture vial containing medium on its side while anesthetizing flies or position the vial at a 45 degree angle with the mouth facing down. Remove the plug from the vial of sleeping flies and tap them onto the sorting card. Place the sorting card on the stage of the stereoscope with the power as low as it can be. Using a fine brush, sort the flies into groups of males and females. In general, the posterior part of the abdomen is much darker and more rounded in males than in females. Also, females usually are larger than males. Sex in flies is important when culturing Drosophila and making genetic crosses. Once all females have been confirmed as virgins, anesthetize them and the males needed to perform the cross. Add six virgin females and males to each new vial. Allow them to mate for three to five days, then remove them from the culture. Once the new adults emerge, you can accumulate data on the genotypic and phenotypic ratios. Also, they may be used to produce another generation. Visit carolina.com slash genetics to see all of our Drosophila supplies and kits and thousands of other products for your classroom.